Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the Adams Family Mystery Mansion. Grim here again. I would be going ahead and stalling this, but uh, they they release this update during the other update, so uh, might as well spoil it now. It's uh, War on the Wastelands. So uh, yeah, that's that's this update coming up here, as you've probably seen from the title. Anyways, uh, here here's the video. So yeah, you get a good hint of that, and uh, frankly, uh, the art is uh, pretty pretty nice. Here's the close-up right there, as you get a good look at that. I also want to mention the music they chose for the actual uh, event. Kind of sounds like one of those car commercial rock music you kind of expect. Just like, you know, the 18 one and <laughs> I'm just trying to make up stuff on the fly, but eh, I don't know. Uh, right. All right. So let's just go ahead and do the email thing, and let's just go ahead with that, shall we? Let us teleport you to our new event, War on the Wastelands, and what an event indeed to start this off. <laughs> I wasn't joking by the end of it by saying that it was going to be interesting. Are you ready for some madness? You, you bet I am. Let's take read about this here. Uh, if I can actually, let me just. There you go. There we go. All right. So let's read. A new year begins, and the Adams family is ready for mayhem and a new adventure. As the family is putting the holiday decorations away, the time traveler arrives, that being um, Agatha. She needs materials to fix her time traveling teleporter and decides to make a pit stop on this era as she knows her distant ancestors can help her. They agree to help her, as she is of use to them. But Pugsley starts playing with the teleporter, which malfunctions and opens a teleportal rift in the mansion. Now the Adams family must help the time traveler close the rift before time and space collapse. You know that scene from, um, I'm trying to think, I guess, I don't know what the real movie is from, but there's like a scene in The Simpsons where the house decides to destroy itself. Yeah, imagine that's going to happen at the Adams mansion. Alright, so let's see. What's new? We got a few pictures here about some items, the cookie box, Wednesday, and then the stairs. When, let's read. One new seasonal cookie box, ten new seasonal outfits such as ugly sweater gum. Oh. Oh, oh. Um. Hmm, someone, uh, someone forgot to, uh, change this. Hmm, okay. Well, uh, that, that's, uh, that's awkward. All right. Well, uh, let's let's move on then. Uh, have the cookie is January with this new event. Okay, we will do that instead. So, here are some of the pictures. Here's the one inside the mansion, and then here's the one for the outside of the mansion. And uh, yeah, as you you probably expect, what's going to be happening with this game? I mean, it's the same as always. New new skins, new stuff. The catacombs have been updated, so yeah. Anyways, let's just dive into the game. Uh, more or less, just more talking before we get into the game. You know, you know the gist. It's been like how many updates now? Thirty something. It's, you get it. And as per usual, here is the update patch notes that we're getting from Apple because you know Apple has the more um, content as far as stuff goes. Uh, Android is basically like Twitter and limited to what you can say. So, there's that. They also did a post basically advertising this new update when it came out, and of course, with the video as we saw originally, but you know, done in that post form. And what's interesting is they actually shown off uh, the update when it's actually going to be ending. According to this, it's the 29th of January, which that doesn't give you a whole lot of uh, month, actually. That's like probably the. Yeah near the end of Sunday, so uh, I guess we'll see what happens there. Last but not least, let's go ahead and dive in and show you this, which is the um, Avatar main one, which is with Morticia as the main front, and uh, you get a nice picture of the mansion, which is actually pretty good. They've been advertising the other apps uh, icons instead, which is interesting. I'm not sure why the choice is there, but there you go. And, uh, yeah, there, there's that. I do apologize on the quick, uh, 
go ahead, but, uh, you know, I figured I'd make it something interesting every time I try to do these, so let's just go ahead and do that. So, we're jumping into the game now, the new year of 2023, January the 2nd, right after New Year's. The update went live. War on the Wastelands. And uh, quite an interesting idea for this premise. Uh, it's very Mad Max, in a sense. I do like that. And um, the story of how it's happening is somewhat interesting, too. But yeah, they already did the update. And as you can see, this is still here, which I'm actually working on slowly. But that's not the only reason I'm doing this. The other reason is because... Um, what else? Well, okay, let's just have Parker finish this off for me. And, um, let's see. You are done with that, Morticia. Thank you. I still have yet to design everything, so I do apologize on that. So don't worry. I will fix that eventually. Um, before this event begins, I'm assuming this week at some point. But the other reason, too, I'm recording this is because of this here. Now that we have some lighted candles, they're great for burning cobwebs. <laughs> they still produce an acrid smoke, and there's still no sign of the wine cellar. I can tell we're getting close. You're complaining more already. Ha 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 ha, funny. Alright, so we got that done. So, um, yeah, I'm still going to be waiting on that one bundle. That's supposed to be, you know, for the one thing, if you know what I mean. You know what I mean, right? The uh, the one thing? Yeah, you do. The um, the bundles, this uh, here, that, this coming up. If it loads. Yeah, this, the Winter's Wrath. I'm still waiting for the bundles to pop up here because, you know... Me not needing to use the diamonds would be best, but, um, yeah, you know, it's what it is. How long have we been walking down here? It feels like an eternity. It's not much farther. In fact, I see something up ahead. Look at all those stacks of bottles. This must be it. Is this a wine cellar or a disaster area? Everything looks like it's destroyed. Margo, you need to learn to recognize Adam's decor. This is what we like. Yeah, so unveil the wine machine, which I did. Uh, leaky barrels and rusty chandelier. Spider in a bottle, by the way, is what it's called. And uh, speaking of uh, the catacombs, that's the next level that they're adding to this update. So at least we get to see a little bit of what it is, maybe. But anyways, two of these. So 40, which I can actually do. And the other one is, okay, 60. So that means I need to raise up to 10,000 coins. That sucks. Like, really, it does. Oh, God. Man, they really are just taking me up for a ride, aren't they? But yeah, I should be back with this to get this kind of going. And hopefully we'll get the bundle stuff. Um, most likely, depending on how long this is going to be before the event launches, will depend on how, um, how base, uh, how, how do I put this? Basically, I've been kind of trying to figure out the part ones, twos, and threes, how long this should be. So I'll figure that out along the way. So I should be back momentarily to finish this off. And then hopefully we will get the, uh, the new thing. I'm assuming this update will hit sometime Friday because, again, this is still going on with this event here, which we have 11 more hours left. So, yeah, almost done. <laughs> Probably 5 in the morning or 6 in the morning at this point. So, yeah, but, yeah, we're basically done at this point. Anywho, I shall return when stuff happens. So, you know, the deal. Seeing how Petunia is still here, I did want to show this off because um, I don't think I ever did this when they updated the um, the stuff. Like, for example, Petunia will consume one life if you fail to complete a level. Basically, that image there. Um, I, I think they added that as soon as they added the life system in place. 
Um, complete goals, right it out, claim your rewards, progress faster, boost levels. Again, she won't be in this update for sure, but I wanted to just showcase this because I think this must have changed since she was first introduced slightly. So, yeah, interesting. Also, some time has passed. She's done with this. So then I can do this. Got the rubies. Fantastic. All right, well, now that that's done, now we just wait until the event starts to pop up and uh, say goodbye to the previous one that's still here. So there we go. We're back in the simulation while we wait for the update because we have enough for this electric car here. So let's go ahead and start this off. And while I wait, I might as well get some more material for um, the bolts, which I believe that's Lurch is doing, right? There he is. You can get me... No. Well, I mean, she can too, but... Somebody gives me the bolts. I know that. Wait, what does she need in order... Oh, she just needs to level up. I don't know. Somebody here gives me bolts. That's for sure. But, uh, I guess I'll figure it out of my off time. I guess. Oh, boy. I thought somebody did. I, I could have sworn someone did for me. Um... Okay, that's not good. <laughs> I know someone does. I just... Who is it? Is it Fester? Because Fester is already doing something else. Maybe Cousin It? Is it... Is it Thing? No. But he can do something once uh, the car is unlocked, so that's cool. I guess I have to remember that. But, um... Yeah, now it's your my last. Yes, okay, so you're the one who does it. Okay, cool. Alright, well, um... I shall return when the car is back done, I guess, in this case, since uh, that's going to be the first thing that's going to pop up instead of the event. So, uh, yeah. Well, the holiday stuff is done. Uh, something I wanted to make a note of is, apparently, I'm hearing this right now, the Christmas music is not here anymore. Which makes sense, but still, it's kind of like, oh, <laughs> well, I guess we still have the winter stuff, so that's good. But anyways, yes, as you can see, the Snow Horse Pack is now here. Winter's Raft, Wendigo. We have four Snow o Lanterns, which is cool. Cold Embrace, which is actually really creepy. And then we got a bunch of stuff here like that, legendary stuff and blah, blah, blah. All right, let's see how this works. By the way, ooh, 10 bucks. Man, I'm so glad I'm working to get money because, honestly, this would be a pain. But yeah, now we're just waiting for the new event to pop in. So anyways, let's just see the cold embrace. Um, we need to put this somewhere. You know what? There is that, yeah, from last year. Can I put that near there? No, unfortunately not. Can I put it somewhere close by? I could put it there, but I'm not 100% sure if it will be needed for an animation. Yeah, we got the Windigo. And the Winter's Wrath. So, I guess let me just see <clears throat> with them if that's the case. It's possible, but let's just see real quick. I switched into them. Oh, their thing is not there anymore for some reason. Um, It'll be interesting to see exactly what be the new... Yeah, it'll be interesting to see what happens in the... <laughs> yeah, so that's one thing I'll say that I actually like is the fact that once the event's over, they reset and put the things back to where it's supposed to be over here. All right. So anyways, Winter's Wrath. Winter's Wrath. Let's see. We need to see the ice magic. So I want to do this, but I don't know where you are at the moment. So I'm going to hold off just yet. And Pugsley, let's see you and your Windigo. Interesting design, by the way, with the Windigo. Oh, well, okay, so this is a little bit wonky still. But uh, I'm sure they'll probably fix this at some point properly. But anyways, let's see this. Do you need the ice? I hope you don't. It actually would work better because you can technically get this and not have to deal with putting anything else in. So it's not a... No, it's not. Okay. So um, so that's good that um, you do not need to buy the bundle in order for this to work. In the past, that seemed to have been the case, which kind of sucked. But this time around, that doesn't seem like that's there. So that's good. All right. So now I know where you are. Let's go ahead and see... Uh, 
that's that sword there. Practice scaring. All right, so this is what you do. So you kind of, yeah, so I get it. So he's, you know, as it's saying, practice scaring. So he's trying to scare and um, that's the most of it there. Okay, cool. All right, well, now let's see if we can find Wednesday and see her animation and be done with that for now. Can I get the bomb? Thank you. Oh, there she is. I did it by accident, but uh, yeah, I found her. Anyways, now let's see the one here. There he is, Ice Magic. Oh, fantastic. Why do you have to put it over there? So let's see this. Okay. So she's making... Is that like a skull? And then it shatters. So I guess it's like an ice skull or something. I'm not sure. It just looks like it. It kind of looks like a mushroom too at the same time. So... Yeah, so we get that kind of thing there, over there, and there you go, and then it shatters. All right, sounds good. You can do that. All right, so I guess now let's put down the pumpkin lanterns, the snow lanterns, my bad. I could put one there. I'm wondering if I have enough room to put all of them. Well, I kind of do. Yeah. I mean, I could do that there. I don't want to... I mean, I could do that there as well. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot better than hiding over here. That's for sure. I feel like I shouldn't um, tempt fate to put all of them down. Because if I did, then, you know, like, look at the amount of crap I got going on right now. I have too much. Oh, by the way, hi, Crow. Still has the Santa hat on, which is good. So we still got that. It's snowing, by the way, too. So, yeah. Um, that's, that's what's going on right now. I mean, I could probably put... I'll put one down just to show you what it looks like. So there you go. Yeah. I'm going to hold it off because... Um... I just because, I guess, just for space reasons. <laughs> oh, God. <clears throat> that, that made me uh, sneezy for some reason. And I can't go up there. All right, so I'll leave that there. I love how these just is just so useless now. They're just sitting there waiting to go back to simulation, but I don't need to do that anymore because of the update. So I, I do appreciate that. So there you go. That's That's the pack there. So, we got that done. So now... Oh, good. We're getting the cheerleaders. That's nice. That's something I need. So now, all we have to do... Oh, we got another suit of armor, which kind of helps me with... Uh, what exactly? It, oh, God. It's all the way at the bottom, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Why? Uh, so this helps me with getting... I think... What was it? Oh, yeah. It gives me that. I don't need that. It's, th it's the thought that counts, but still. Oh, cool. So they finally popped this up. So at least we got to see what this looks like. So that's kind of cool. Okay, I accidentally clicked my uh, recording to stop. Then this. So I meant to do this. Thank you. <clears throat> I mean, we're going to stop it anyways pretty soon. All right. And then we're getting some stuff for the grape. So that's good. And then we got a rare. All right. Oh, and then we got this out. That's that's nice, too. I don't care, though. All right, so that's it for now. So I guess we'll return once the event starts, because there's nothing really else to do as far as that is there. Everything has been changed. And by the looks of it, I think a lot of the family members are going to be partaking in this. The main ones, anyway. So that's be interesting. <clears throat> but, um... Everything else, though, I'm going to be... We're going to have to wait and see. But... Ah. Uh, Fester, why are you doing the moonwalk? Okay, well, that... All right, you're showing your smooth moves there. Oh, God. <clears throat> all right, that's about it. Thanks. We're back in the simulation to finish off this. So we got the electric car now. All we need to do is we have to customize this. 
There's a bunch of different versions. I mean, we can buy all of them if we really want to, which, you know what? We'll do that. Because I'm just that kind of guy. Let's go ahead with the black. Yeah. These electric cars are great for smaller people, uh, but I don't think I can fit in one. That's okay, Ringo. You can even be more trendy by walking, not even having a car. Like a loser like me. Just think of what great shape I'll be in if I do that. There you go. All done. Uh, before I do that, though, let me go ahead and go to Thing real quick yeah race car so let's do this let's see if it's one of those animation things or if it's going to be one of those uh disappear in the building things so let's see this here we go and oh verdict says new animation that's cool <laughs> it's called race car so yeah, I can see that. But yeah, certainly having fun in there. That's cool. Alright, cool. Good, good. Let's just see what Marco wants now. Uh, if I can click. <sighs> the suburbs. Where living is good and every lawn is well manicured. <sighs> and specifically, perfection is prized above all else. Right, Marco? You won't be so judgmental after you enjoy a nice picnic, Gomez. Sounds good. Pickled newt sandwiches are my favorite. Build a picnic table. Customize the picnic table. Picnic pick-me-up. Hmm. So I need to put this somewhere. I guess... Hmm. What would the picnic be good for? Oh, let's screw it near Marco's place. She wanted it. There. So I need wood. And I need this. Which I think someone's already given me that. Yes. You are. And someone does give me wood, but I don't know who exactly. Because let me just see real quick. I don't think it's him. I don't know, it's probably not you. Is it Gomez? No. Morticia. No. Pugsley. If I can click. No. Grandma. No. Kitty. No. Lurch? No. You. Parker. No. Oh, wait. I know who it was. It's Marco. Great. It took me a while and I figured it out. Marco, thank you. Town meeting you go. Alright, so we should get everything here ready. And, uh, yeah, that'll be into that. So Marco will be doing that. This will be an hour, whatnot. And we'll see how long it'll take before the event goes live. I didn't log in for Friday for the sole purpose of seeing you. Yes, finally did it. First of the Saturday of the month and I got ya. So let's see what you got. Speaking of, we're going to actually see you as part of the main quest uh, limited time thing, apparently. So this will be interesting. So I guess I'm going to have to voice her a little bit more. Ooh. Is that what I think it is? It is. It's the centerpiece I never got before it because of stupid thing. Oh. We got the gardening club thing. We got um, St. Patrick's event for 2021. New Year's family reunion. I think this is the second one. And then this is the holiday one. I think for second thing there. You know what? Because this thing, for the price it is, mm, yeah, Merry Christmas to me, I finally using her service. 
I'm so sick of doing business with you. Let's hope this doesn't cause any temporal paradox. Oh, well, first time I actually see her talking this time. Although, to be fair, I'm going to have to be voicing her a bunch. If the time police ask, you didn't see me. I'll be back next month with some more treasures from the past. Farewell! Oh, really? You only buy one of these? Interesting. Well, at least I got my thing back. Did you see that? She jumped into the portal. Whoa. Thanks for in-app purchase. You ruined it. God, I wanted to see that. Anyways, it should have worked, which means I should have had a copy of this somewhere. There it is. Oh my God. This the okay. For those who are wondering why I'm so freaking out about this, this is the first ever centerpiece we got in the game. But you want to know something? You could never get this back because they never added this back until now. Oh, oh my God. And I think it's permanent too. It is. Oh, finally. I got this back. It's stupid because I won it. But because the skins were not a thing, this never existed. So now it is. I'm still... God. That was interesting, though. I will give it that. But yes. I finally got this thing back. So let's put this down. Sell this. There it is. The first ever thing. And it disappeared because of like you can watch it in the in the old previews. I think this was back in March that it happened. Because it just, you know, things happened. So I can go back to this. Okay, good, so it's still there. Oh my god. <laughs> you have no idea. I was so pissed because that didn't happen. And mind you, they don't really offer anything like that unless you don't have it. So that was that was such a thing. Unless they did put it in there, or they did fix it and I already had it. it. You know what? Screw it. It was just, what, two bucks or so. And if anything, it was a good way to kind of see what happened with the time traveler. So, yeah. All right. No, oh, there you go. Might as well open the box while I'm here. Ah, oh, it's a common. <laughs> Whatever. Right, so... Monday is going to be when the event is live, hopefully. So the next clip should hopefully be that. But stay tuned. I'm back again with Spring Valley. Um, it seems like they're changed the icon again to this. I guess it's supposed to be... Kinda Wednesday, but not really. I don't know what this is supposed to be. What are you? Why are you doing this? I hate you so much. The update is live. And now we're going to see this new content and what the director has in mind. So this will be interesting just to see what is added, what is new, and uh, how this whole story is going to go about. So I'm looking forward to it. It's interesting that last year we got a new director and now we have a new director starting this year. So there we go. Cool. All right, so we got that there. All right, so interesting design. It looks like we got some sort of caps as far as our currency goes. Rusted looking background as far as... Sorry, I'm just... Oh. Give me a sec. A little, a little girl just came in to say hi. Sorry about that. Anyways, um, yeah, so rusted looking. Like It makes sense. It's interesting to go with the blue. But, uh, hey, I'm not there. Um, let's see. So this is Meta Shredder. So this is the a producer item. And it gives us metal plates. So that's the main thing here. Level 10, we get our first item, which is the Car Wheels Armchair. And then it also has Wasteland Costume for Parker. Keep on going. Number 15 get the SAR lights and gear skull interesting continue number 20 we have 
Broken Automation. And then we have Junker Pyromaniac for Pugsley. 25, we have, I don't know what it is. Something tells me they might be craftable or something, but uh, it doesn't say anything. And then we have a metal armor, which is interesting because we haven't had any metal armors since the only weird one we got was the food one. So that's June, so it's almost like half a year. Anyways, then we have weapons table. Okay, move on. Number 30, we have the Wasteland Warrior. We have the Rusty Dex Desk. Then we have Rusty Shelf. Man, a lot of items. We have our centerpiece and then our missile skin, most likely. Because we've got another one. We have the Junk Golem, which is this. Interesting design, I'll say, especially with how they designed it there. Hanging saws, which is interesting. Uh, the stairs, right there. Training dummy. Okay. And then our last prize is the barrel thrower. And we have three, we have three weeks to complete this, so hopefully we'll be able to do it. So let's see. We have the mechanical hand. The damaged cables. Okay, so I guess Fester has to do that. Metal arm, which also comes with a piece of engine engine which um Pugsley will probably have to do that rusty chain savage chainsaw blunt axe blade desert battle axe the desert mask spiker hook so what would be the grand so interesting so there is no hey, look at this yeah, that's weird. So we don't have an item that's like everything together. Odd. Really odd. Oh well. So now we have this. So Wasteland Stalker is our grand prize there. Let's see. The gold pass comes with this. So not too much. Wasteland Warriors Pack comes with Grandma and uh, Fester. Metal Vulture. Which is animated, mountain scrap, junk, uh, junk ramp, fire fountain. Oh, that's cool. All right, so then we got event currencies there as well. All right, so there's that. Got the scavengers pack, which is costume for um, Orphelia, junker pet for Kitty, watchtower, chain curtain, scavenger hunt. Our hut. More fire fountains. That's going to be interesting. It'll be interesting to see how they design the mansion type of thing. Yeah, so it's been a while. Cool. Alright. So, we have you. Hello. Not too much. Alright. Our quest is... Oh, a fire fountain. If we want another one. And we need a few things. Five days. Ew. I might not be able to get that. I know I keep on saying that, but like I'm probably not going to get that. <laughs> because buying the bundles, most likely I'm going to get the more than enough. But it's there, I guess. But five days, yeah, I don't think so. Let's see this. Desert Wheels Pack. So this comes with Mechanic for Lurch. It's Grappy Hand for thing road ranger i think everyone's involved except for sloom and socrates and um ichabog i believe by the looks of it i'm going to assume yeah so i'm just obs um, up, uh, observing everything here so yeah it seems like that's the dealio with what's going on here and of course, you know, we have this, and we have this, so we can actually complete, actually, now that we think about it. So, gotta, great, gotta suit armor, which I don't want, but, uh, there you go. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna look at this, so, a new chair. I wonder what they're advertising here for the chair, unless it's a skin, which is possible. Let's see. 
Yeah, it's the centerpiece thing. Oh, I hear a crow. Oh, there goes Santa hat. I guess that makes sense, but still. Disappointing. Disappointed. Oh, yeah, I got that too. That's fun. Cool. Uh, yeah, that's unfortunate. Oh, well. It was bound to happen. Anyways, we got this, which is applications. So most likely skins again, if I'm not mistaken. Let's find out. If we go down. Most likely they'll appear at some point. Let's see. Yep, the missile. And then there's another one. Yeah, the armor. I figured. And then, of course, we have that. Um, oh, we can actually buy a fire fountain. You know what? I'll probably do that instead of getting it. Because it's just 50, 50 cents. So, you know, if I need to make it clear, I'll do that. So let's put this down because we're going to be needing it for the stuff. Every four hours. Okay. Let me just open up a box and uh, complete one of their quests. Okay, well, there we go. Something I'll add to before I click on this button is lately I've been getting ads, but then there's a little pop-up that kind of comes in to kind of press the exit before the thing clears, and and then it lets me continue as if that was that was approved. I don't know what it is, if it's just my phone updated, something like this, or I don't know what. It, it seemed weird, but anyways. And there you go. One down. And we're already moving progression-wise. So we got that there. Okay. Got this, of course. Got the scavengers. So let's see this. Hmm. Interesting colors. Okay. Alright. Sounds easy enough. I guess I can give you that. And, of course, there's our quest. And it's going to be a while for this because of the money I need. I need, like, 40,000 more coins to get to 100,000 coins altogether. But anyways, um, I guess... You know what? Let's... Um, I'm trying to debate if we should start the quest now or... No, you know what? We won't do that just yet. Let's just look at the costumes and see what they need. So let's go to Gomez. And of course, it's going to be a little while. Yep, so we got the Wasteland Warrior. And he gives us show off. Doesn't seem like we need anything for him. Morticia. Um, let's see this. Yeah, we have to claim it. And she gives us, oh, we need the training dummy, which is warm up. By the time we get it, we probably already have the dummy. So, you know, then we have Wednesday. Let's see this. Yeah, the we Reaper. And I believe she's the unlockable during the prize track. Seems like Electric Harvest. Okay. Pugsley, which we've seen as the Pyromaniac. See this? Yeah, the Pyromaniac. There he is, or the Junker. And it gives us Desert Mask, Explosive Tricks. All right. Now... Fester and Grandma are interesting because they're the special packs that's going to come the Legendary. Um, so we have Futuristic, Apocalyptic, Mad Max style. And then we have Prehistoric. So both Grandma and Fester has Prehistoric costumes that are going to be coming later on. So we have the Wasteland Warrior. And now if we go over here, there it is, Caveman. All right, interesting. And uh, Scavenge. For the mountain scrap. Give me a sec. Anyways, where was I? Right, right. So we've seen the mountain scrap. We were going to read exactly what it was exactly. Uh, scavenge. Okay. And now let's see if the Booga Booga has anything. Oh, he does. Stone TV. Change the channel. I guess it's going Flintstone style. Also, 35 is unlocked. Taste the uh, merchandise. So we're going to go down into the 
the catacombs to see what's going on. We're not going to go to assimilation because there's nothing updated for assimilation, but we will go down just to see exactly what's going on down there. Won't be able to see anything because, you know, things have happened. Anyways, we've got the dust twitch. We continue on. There it is, cave woman. Now then, uh, we got the sharpened metal. It gives us metal, so, you know, not that exciting for her. We have the stone bed, which is the friend below. All right. And, uh... Wait a minute. I thought I had this. What are you talking about? I don't have it. That is weird. I thought... What the... Okay. Um. All right, that's... That's weird. I could have sworn I had that down before. But I guess not. Well, it's there now. I'm not sure why. Oh yeah, and Cousin It's not doing anything, so... Yeah, so there we got that. Alright, so the mechanic, he does. We need the Road Ranger. And it's fixed the engine. Makes sense. And then we have... Ant Sloom is not doing anything. However, Thing has a costume, which I'm gonna... Oh yeah, he does partake. My bad. I don't know what was wrong with me. Wasteland costume... And she does frustrated tinkering because of the mechanical hand. Okay. Let's see, Kitty. Let's see what he does. Okay. It is chain chain curtains taking a bite. All right, that'll be interesting to see. And we got Thing, which we've seen before. And let's see what he does. We, okay, gives us the middle arm. And now, yeah, so both of them, so now it's just Ophelia. Apparently, Ica oh yeah, Ichabog is not a partaking either because, again, the costume he has is the one there. So, Watchtower, Guard, the Mansion. So, I guess that's all the characters now, the partaking of what they drop. Yeah, as I thought, because it's the Cherry Blossom Tree. And unfortunately, there's no characters that basically said, ah, oh, we need um, a new thing going on there, you know, as you would expect. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to the uh, downstairs, the catacombs, to see the new area that's got unlocked, which I guess is 35. So let's see that right now. All right. So like I said, it's going to be hard to see. Again, what? what's going on with you? Why are you glitched like that? That's weird. I don't like that. That's creepy. Yeah, and then you're back to normal. So, 35. This. The Drool Crafting Halls. Gotcha. Alright. So, what about 34? Does 34 not exist? Okay, that's weird. I wonder how they're going to level up to 34, but... Apparently, there's something new here. Oh, yeah, it's that, um... I know what it is. It's probably at the way bottom, isn't it? Yeah, there it is. Let's put him down. Let's click the bomb, which is normal. And, uh, let's sell this guy off. Yes. All right, well... Oh, my God. Kitty, why are you glitch? Oh, God, I, I don't like this. It's not liking up here. Alright, so we're going to go back upstairs and uh, we'll see the mansion from uh, Pixel's perspective to see if they have it in there. So let's do that. Sorry, I just want to add that you can't really look at other people's friends in uh, down here anymore. Oh, um, okay. Well, that... <laughs> well, that happened. Well, you know what? Maybe we might as well see what's going on there. Oops, the neighbor has a different version of the game installed. Please try again later. Um, right, I think I've seen this error before, and I have a feeling that upstairs is going to be the same thing, so get me ready for that. All right, we're back up in the mansion, so now we're going to see what happens if we were to look at the neighbors. So let's see if we can do that. All right, let's try it. Oops, the neighbors has a different version of the game installed. Looks like we won't be able to see them just yet, because apparently they haven't updated their things as of right now. Well, it's been a few days, and um, an update has hit. Basically brought this thing back, so we're going to get to see 
what the mansion holds. So it's going to be weird to be adding this in part one because this is technically during part two, but you know, it's, it, you don't care, right? You don't care what's coming up here, or what goes on there, but uh, gives you a bit of something. Also, there's two robots here, which I only think you get the one. I do like that, that the, they're using the fire thing. It's just really cool. I like that. And then we got some stuff here. And we... Seems like... Yeah, at least we get some idea of what's going on here. As far as what characters are going to do and what they need. Interesting. And then, of course... You know, we got... Oh, these birds are mechanical too. Interesting. So they actually move around. And... Oh, Puxy's doing the same. Hold on a second. Is he doing... Let's see this animation. Oh. Yeah, so he falls down and does that. Okay, we're going to have to look into that when, when the thing comes in here. But, uh... Yeah, so we got some stuff going on here, which is kind of cool. I do like that. Also, the house. Where did the house come from? I think it must have been one of the packs, but I wasn't paying attention. But, uh, yeah. Well, I mean, it's kind of cool what they got going on there as far as um, the design stuff goes. You know, like, uh, I do dig. Oh, by the way, the balloon. Might as well get that. Oh, nice. It's the event thing, which I need. Good. But uh, anyways, what I was saying. Oh, yeah. Like, I do dig how they've kind of designed the mansion to be kind of custom. And then they kind of added their own thing. Like, they turned the bathroom here into um, a workout room. And, you know, it's it's just like you gotta love how they designed it. Not like my nightmare, but partially because I just didn't tend to hold, like, I don't want to store anything. I don't know how much storage space I got. But anyways, I digress. So there's your sneak preview of what to expect. And part twos and part threes will take a look more in depth with each animation. So we'll see which one we get first. But until then, we'll go back into the gameplay as perspected. So... We're going back now. All right. Well, that kind of sucks for them, but oh well. Things have happened. Things usually do. All right. So that's things about it that I can do and show you right now. So let's go ahead and just dive into this quest line and see how the story goes, shall we? Help me pull away these holiday decorations, sis. There are so many. I'm busy in sharpening my axe, dear brother. But, uh... Who's that at the door? It's me, the time traveler. I need some materials to fix my time teleporter. <laughs> ah, of course, the time traveler. Nice to see you again. <laughs> um, all right. Well, this is the first time, I guess. I mean, you were talking to the mansion, but I guess this is like, all right. I'm not gonna question it. Come in. We can help. Just put your device down while you put away your coat. And Pugsley in no way, shape at all will be messing around with it and causing problems. Like it was said, a tease in the quest line. Aren't you, Pugsley? Look at that face. You know you're not going to do that. Trouble with time. Alright, so now we need to get two metal plates. So, and uh, I'm just curious real quick. Mm, eh, that's, that's what I feared. Alright, well, that's it for now. There's not much else I can do. And I think that's about it as far as things go. I don't know why Kitty's glitched, by the way. That's weird. But at any rate, we will um, go ahead and do things and um, see where we go from there. I think we'll go for one more quest. And then after that, we'll end it and go into part two. And uh, then see how that goes. So yeah, let's let's just have one more video into this, and then we'll, I guess, end it. That's that's my feel feelings. Um, we'll we'll see what ends up happening. I I have no idea how long this video is as of right now. It looks like we're about to actually test out this new box here. This new cookie box. What is it called exactly? The Wasteland Cookie Box. All right, let's see this. Ooh, look how spooky he looks. 
All right, let's see what I get. I do like that. Nice opening and all that stuff. It's kind of cool. Again, they do a good job adding certain things there. Right, so I picked one of these. So next clip is going to be me getting the thing in question. And then we'll end off the quest. And then we'll end this video. And then part two. And uh, I'm not going to be sure exactly how far it's going to be because 19 days. Ooh. And here's the other thing too. I'm looking at this and honestly, it's a it's going to be a pain to get all the especially for this here. It needs the metal stuff and it's like I'm not going to bother. You know what? If I wanted it, it's a lot cheaper just to buy one here, right? But I'm going to get 5 anyways, most likely do the deals, so you know, it's going to be one of those things where I'm not going to bother with it. I know. It, still, why are you so creepy, kitty? It's glitchy. What is not glitchy nowadays, huh? Not a whole lot. Anywho, I shall return when something fun, interesting happens. So, yeah, be right back for the whole thing to happen. Sorry, just one last thing that I just remembered to talk about. So, it... When I was listening to the spooky music for Christmas, something I just noticed is that for some reason, I don't know how long ago this happened. Probably it was like a year or so ago. But the normal song you're listening to now must have been edited. And what I mean by that is that the, the song must have been shut, uh, co closed down or shortened because there's a bit in the song where it's supposed to go like... Um, Extended going like, ooh, you know, it, it's hard to explain, but if you listen to the original, um, like Christmas song, there's like an extra bit that happens in this, this minute here. So it, I don't know if they, they changed it to shorten it or what exactly happened, but, uh, yeah, they certainly changed it. Like, for example, hold on a second. Let's just see what happens here. Okay, so let's let's see what happens. Yeah, it ends. Because if you listen to the Christmas music, it goes... Right? But no, it's not here. So, that's strange. I don't know how long ago they changed it, but... Oh, now I crow. But yeah, weird. All right. Here we go. Let's click on this, continue with the story, and end part one. Oh, thanks! I didn't need that. Thank you for inviting me. Now, to look at my teleporter. Uh, wait, where did it go? Hmm, I wonder where it went. Hmm. Over here, lady. I'm taking your device for a spin. <laughs> uh, what's that weird noise? Pugsley. No, you didn't. It's not function, you fool! You created an unstable teleporter riff! Is that bad? If you don't close the riff, the magic will be destroyed! Ooh, okay, that that is that is very bad. Don't worry, dear. We won't let the collapsing of reality destroy our home. Lurch, call the rest of the family. We have work to do. <laughs> I just realized the things are bottle caps, the, um, actual... Nice. Um, the actual, uh, what do you call it? Things? I had, like, all the Christmas stuff is gone now. But, uh, I meant, uh, the, the event currency and all that. But, uh, the other thing, too, um, what was it? Yeah, yeah, you know what, might as well put the thing down. Yeah, all right. Uh, what, what, what did I have in mind? Oh, God, I don't know. Alright, let's just continue. Um, I thought I had it. Did I just see some car wheels flying through the living room? Oh, yes, now I know what I was going to say. Wouldn't it be cool if they actually had, like, cars or whatnot, like, you know, actual tappables type things and a little rift? Like a little an event area to kind of show off. Yeah, that's what this, this thing's missing. The little event areas. That would have been nice, but, you know, I guess another game did it better. 
Yeah, someone accidentally opened the teleport rift in the mansion. Yes, and I wonder who that someone is. Hmm? A way to put these strange items to use. Let's make a chair out of those wheels. Great. I like the idea of feeling like I'm going fast when I'm sitting in the house. I know what item we're getting next. Yep, a family ref. Place the car wheels in an armchair. Obtain rusty chains. So that's our first thing we need to do. Fortunately, we can get that for now. And the actual thing... Oh, we're getting close to getting it, so that's good. So, hopefully this Friday comes to deals and whatnot. Um, I'll be taking a look into that. Hopefully that will be the case. But I digress. So, with that in mind, I think that will end part one. And we shall continue on going from there and seeing how things are, uh, are going to turn out. I'm quite interested in seeing the... The, the wackiness of this whole thing and um, trying to figure out how I'm going to decorate this side of the mansion with um, the event stuff. So, um, yeah, wish me luck. Also, uh, yeah, not doing this. Sorry. And that, ladies and gentlemen, ends the War on the Wastelands Part 1. What an interesting introduction. We got to see the Time Traveler and we actually got to see something of the past. So, that's interesting. This uh, whole time thing makes sense for something for January, but uh, not in the same way as you think. But, hey, it is interesting with their theming. But I digress. Anyways, we are going to take a rest for now and come back in part two to see what kind of shenanigans that they're up to and if they can survive their home. I've been Grim, and I'll be seeing you next time for some more Adam's Family Mystery Mansion. Specifically the war on the wastelands. Until then, gear yourself up because the apocalypse is coming. <laughs>